everyone. I hope all of you are having a great day today. Today is October 7th, 2016, and right now I'm in a transition between my previous job and my current job. So I have a couple days off. I have like two days off, including the weekend, which is awesome. And today I'm just going to bring you guys with me throughout my day. So um, today I have a few errands I have to run. I do have to work out today. I have to go shopping for some new shoes. I might buy some new workout shoes for my new job. And... I do have to price out some tires for my car. And I'll take you guys with me. I'm also meeting my girlfriend later tonight. Not sure what we're going to do, but I'm going to bring you guys with, and I hope you guys enjoy the video, and let's get to it. All right, guys, so before I get going to the gym, I'm going to buy some new shoes first. Um, I already bought some new work shoes that are pretty nice. I mean, they're just regular work shoes. It's going to be for my new job here. And the good thing about these, usually dress shoes are really... Um, Really not comfy, but on the inside of these, it has that cushion. And that'll definitely be good for support, especially when I'm standing around or walking around all day. And on top of that, I have um, Nikes that I wear when I work out and just casually go around. So right now, these are like my newest pair of Nikes I have, which I absolutely love. I do, it's like the Flex Fury 2s. And I have a couple pairs here. Um, I think these are the Nike Free 5.0s. I have two pairs of those. I have the 4.0s. I actually have three pairs of the 5.0s. And I have, um, I love these a lot. I like the color of these Nikes. They're really nice. They're the Nike Flyknit 4.0s. And I like these, and I have these in black somewhere else too. I'm not sure where they are. But today I'm going to buy a new pair because all of those are worn out. And if you wear workout shoes for a long period of time, they do wear down. Yeah, I need the support, especially when I'm doing deadlifts or like heavy squatting. And obviously for running too, if I'm going to do that. But I'm going to head out right now, and let's get to it. All right, guys, so before I do anything, I decided I'm going to get my interior of my car washed. Um, it is cold outside. It's in the 50s right now, and I'm not in the mood to go somewhere and use a vacuum and do that all up. So um, there's a really good place down the street. They do a phenomenal job for a decent price. And I think it comes with a car wash, which I really don't need, but I'm going to do it just because I have these days off now, and it always feels good having a clean car. just left the car wash and I've never been in this place before but my dad has been going to this um, full service car wash for years and they did an amazing job they literally like okay, I used to go to turtle wax close to my old work and they did a decent job but they would half-ass it you know they would it would be decent but it wouldn't be the best but here they went all out like they had like eight people cleaning my car at once it literally took them 25 minutes but the longer they do it the better job they're gonna do which is honestly phenomenal so my car looks great I'll do a quick walk around once I get to the bank I have to go to the bank real quick Man, I have a lot of errands today so I'm gonna go to the bank I'm gonna go buy some shoes and then I'm gonna go to the gym and it's getting later now, I woke up late today. Then I'm gonna meet up with my girlfriend and we'll see where the day takes us. All right guys, so I can't get over how good of a job those people did at that car wash. And I'm not even sure what it's called. It's Fast Eddie's Car Wash, and 
they did a great job. The interior is phenomenal right now. It looks brand new. And it's a $24 wash, so I did full service. They had two above it, but I didn't need that because I just got a car wash exterior recently. But they did the interior vacuum, they did my windows, they did like behind places that I usually wouldn't clean. And it looks phenomenal from the inside and out. So what I'm gonna do is once I get to the gym, I'm gonna do a quick walk around of the car just to show how clean it looks right now. Because when it clean, when it's clean, all I wanna do is honestly look at it, take a picture of it, make a video of it. So I'll do a quick walk around before I head into the gym and I'll talk to you guys when I'm done with that. Yeah, it's kind of windy out here, but I'll show my car real quick. in there the wheels look good tires wheels and usually when I get a car wash even when I go to a full service this black part here always has like um like soap bubbles or water bubbles it looks absolutely immaculate right now and it looks really good. I'm really impressed with what they did. And they even went underneath here, like underneath um, the rear diffuser to clean under there, which most places wouldn't do. But I'm gonna head into the gym right now, get my workout over with. The workouts average about 40 minutes or 45 minutes to an hour and 15 minutes, depending on what muscle groups I'm hitting that day or what I'm doing. So from there, I'm gonna figure out what I'm gonna do for the day because I do wanna go buy some shoes and might not have some time. Um, we'll see what happens. I'm gonna hit the gym right now and I'll talk to you guys in a bit. All right guys, just finished my workout. I still have to do two miles of cardio, but it was arm day today. There's a post-workout pump. I am bulkier than I usually am. And it's weird because I'm like slightly vascular. I'm still bulkier than I want to be. But I don't know, good workout today. Still have to do two miles of cardio. I lifted first, I did five sets of biceps, six sets of triceps. Kind of finish up the cardio right now. Then I have to head home, shower, um, maybe get shoes, but if I can't. I'm going to meet up with my girlfriend. Hey everyone, just smashed my workout. So I did an arm day, biceps and triceps, and I did two miles of cardio at the end. And as of right now, um, my main goal in the gym is to just to maintain strength. Because I'm, I'm strong as it is right now with no injuries. And having no injuries is phenomenal for me. So as of right now, I just want to, as it's like winter's coming up, I'm not going to bulk. I'm just going to try to stay slightly lean, and just to make moderate strength gains because usually in the winter if I gain weight quick I'll make really huge strength gains but when I gain weight I don't want I can't fit in my clothes and I just want to stay moderately lean so I have to get leaner than I am now and stay consistent throughout the winter so right now I'm gonna head to my house shower get ready I have to meet up with my girlfriend in about an hour and a half so I have some time but I'm gonna get ready right now um, I'll take you guys with me and let's do it. Yep, and it's been raining a lot like I've been saying in my last videos. And it finally slowed down today, but God, my car looks really aggressive today. I don't know, I wake up every morning and I absolutely love this car. It definitely does get my day started. Um, let's get this outside cold start going and we'll get going. so loud in the morning. Alright guys, yeah, you can't really tell from the video here, but the interior of my car, the floor, even some of the seats, not too bad, but I want my car to be absolutely spotless. So I'm going to do that right now. The place is right down the street. Hopefully they're open. I'm not sure if they stay open when it's colder out, but it's not like absolutely freezing. It's fall right now. so. Um, hopefully they're open. I'm gonna head there right now. And hopefully there's not a wait and let's get to it Or is it a girl on the train? 
I don't know. But me and Steph are at a movie right now at her local yeah. theater, and we're seeing a girl on a train. I've been vlogging all day at home, and I just didn't complete it. Oh, wow. Yeah. So, <laughs> we're seeing this movie right now at this really nice theater, and I'm not really sure what this movie's about, but it's, spo it's supposed thriller? to be good. It's a, thr it's a thriller. Yeah, it's a thriller. It's supposed to be good. We're walking to the theater right now. I'll let you guys know how it is once we're done, and you already babe, it's the movie. Oh. <laughs> okay. Alright, I'll talk to you guys later. Alright, so I got a Slurpee. I got Coca-Cola and half blueberry. But it definitely needs the Coca-Cola in there, it won't be good. Come with me and you're my wife. Easy and we got some popcorn too. But stuff's not eating any of it, but she will. No, I have my water. She'll eat some. In case of emergency, watch your step as you walk to the nearest exit and move a safe distance away. Hey everyone, so I forgot to close out last night's video, so the last thing that me and Steph did, um, we saw that movie, we went home and passed out, um, today we're actually going to uh, Pumpkin Patch, and they have like an exotic animal exhibit where they have giraffes and other animals, and that's going to be on the next video, so um, we're going to do that today. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it was kind of out there. It's just my daily routine and me hanging out with my girlfriend. But I don't know. I enjoy making those videos. Like and subscribe. And if you want to see more of these videos, please click the like button. And I hope you guys have a great day today. And I'll talk to you guys later.